One of the questions that we often get is, what if I have spotty or unreliable internet access? How can I still use the Interactive Practice Studio? And a lot of time this, this has to do with uh, classrooms uh, or during the school day when you can't really access the internet in a reliable fashion. Um, there is a way to make sure that this Interactive pra Practice Studio will still work flawlessly for you. And that again is through this Media Downloader. When I'm in this media downloader, that's one of the green arrow going to the hard disk, I can dump many of the files into my cache. All right, that just puts it to a place in the computer that is easily flushed, uh, where I can access all of these videos or audio for offline use. And that's what these are here for. These are video downloads for offline use. I can select the individual videos that I'd like to have put into my cache, or I can just click here and it'll select all the videos. Likewise, all of the audio is available for me, too, for offline use. I'm in the clarinet book, so these are all the clarinet audio, and the main body of the book audio as well. Again, I can click individual items for download, or I can just click on the whole, uh, the whole gamut, audio downloads for offline use. Now, I'm just going to uh, use the do the audio for now for time's sake and I'll hit get selected items and it's going to dump them all into my cache. Now it's really downloading all of that audio so that when I'm in the interactive practice studio and I click on the speaker icon that it's not going to go to the internet to find the file. It's just going to find it in my cache and play it right away. Now the only caution I have for you on that is that we are constantly updating the Interactive Practice Studio, and our friends at Neil I Chose Music are always uh, making little tweaks to make it a little uh, easier or user-friendly, and uh, sometimes adding material. So if you always live offline once you download this, your IPS will not be the most up-to-date. So every once in a while, you're going to want to put these all back into your cache again so you have the most updated files. And uh, I'll come back to you when it's all uh, finished downloading here. And then I'll show you how it'll work offline. Okay, it's finished putting everything into my cache. And this is just the screen that'll pop up. It tells you what it did. And it just put all of that into the cache. So I'll just hit OK. And I'm going to go back to the book. I'll just go back into the book where I was. I'm going to go ahead and turn off my internet. There, so now I'm, I'm offline. Uh, but I will have access to all of the accompaniment recordings. One, ready, play. And all of the video. Playing in the upper register. So again, I don't have to be connected to the internet to use the IPS now. It's just running it from my Thanks computer. Your lesson, I'll show you how to play in the upper register. So again, if you have spotty or unreliable internet access in your classroom, this is the uh, easiest way to still be able to use the Interactive Practice Studio uh, during those times. Just download everything into your cache or just the items that you need for that particular lesson on that particular day. Turn off your internet so it doesn't search for it when you're in the classroom, and then just use the IPS.